Stepping Stones is Family Drug Support's flagship program. It's a 28-hour course for parents or family members who are going through dealing with someone's drug and alcohol issues. We guide them through the whole process, from the early emotions of fear, guilt and grief and anger, through to learning skills on how to communicate better, how to have effective boundaries and how to keep themselves safe. When our families come here uh, for the first time, it is evident that they have tried everything they can to fix it and to stop it. Um, and there is a sense of powerlessness and helplessness in that space. Families often find that you know, when they're in that space with, with other families, when they're listening to the shared experience of this, um, there's a shift and there is a sense of relief you know, that it's not just me, it's not just what I did or what I didn't do that brought this stuff on. Just hearing how other people have been on the same but different journey was just a huge relief to really uh, give me validation to all the things that I'd been feeling and also yeah, to know that I wasn't alone on this journey was really important. But the workshop and the modules and the way in which it's delivered is just opens up a whole world of, well, you know, I'm not alone and I'm not the only one who's going through this and all of these people in this group have got beautiful family members and they're all going through the same thing and they're all feeling the same as I do and you're just that, you know, wonderful, you know, connectedness to people. Well, firstly, it made my situation feel normal and uh, after spending years feeling like there was something wrong with me as a parent, something wrong with my family, to see how we fit into this framework and that there were many others who also were experiencing these challenges and changes really helped me feel uh, like I was on the right path and also I didn't have to be stuck anywhere. There was, there was the possibility and there was the um, openings for transformation. Okay, so it's run by members of our staff and trained leaders. We run it in all the Australian capital cities and some regional areas. It does take place over two weekends. People have to commit to both weekends. And yeah, it's proven to be very effective. Um, we provide um, frameworks uh, for our families to be able to explore what's going on for them. Really important to understand what's happening with our person in the addiction cycle because once we see what's going on in that space we can identify where our person is and then engage in strategies to um, move them in a forward direction with th the understanding of harm reduction um, as, a, as a, a major key uh, for uh, their well-being and ours. Seeing the addiction cycle mapped out really helped me see how my family fit into the framework and normalised it. Uh, I also saw that there was a possibility for uh, change and it also helped me really accept my girls where they were on this, on this path and I had realised how much resistance I'd had up until then. When we provide strategies around coping and resilience when we bring in some education around harm reduction, when we look at some frameworks where their person is, where we are as a family member, we're all in different stages of space. Stepping Stones is a guided process that takes us through that stuff. And it really uh, helps families come to terms with the reality of the situation um, in a gentle way. We meet people where they're at. Um, there are no rights or wrongs in this space. Um, there's a right to pass in Stepping Stones, which is a very, very important philosophy for family drug support. The Stepping Stones program really opened my eyes to the philosophy of harm reduction. And I didn't really understand it before Stepping Stones. So I found it incredibly helpful to uh, see how this model actually has been hugely healing for my kids, you know, for me to come with understanding and compassion and to accept that this is happening and it doesn't even really matter why. Like that was the other part. I was so stuck in the story of how did this happen to our family? 
And then when I looked around the circle and saw all these beautiful people from all different places and walks of life, I got that it doesn't really matter why. What matters is what can we do now to support our young people moving forward. I think that's one of the most powerful um, experiences that happens in the Stepping Stones program is that we see our person in a different light, which is incredibly important because connection is key in this space. Um, sometimes we have to uh, maintain a distance from our person, but we know uh, from evidence, from families, from working in this space that connection um, is a surefire way um, to get better outcomes. We know that tough love doesn't work. I think what family drug support's done for me is helped me find a different way to, to deal with the situation. And there are a lot of other models out there that have different ways of dealing with things, but because of the person that I am, I couldn't do the harsh, cruel, you know, well, throw them out the house kind of thing. The Stepping Stones was a complete re-education in the power of words that I had been using. From being clean and enabling and rock bottom and all of those, you know, words that you hear out in the world uh, in association with drug use and drug addiction, that's what I was saying. And I, can, I understand how damaging that can be to someone who's on the receiving end of it and just how they perceive themselves when they think of themselves as dirty versus clean. Um, and also how if I was actually supporting my child in the best way that I could, that's not enabling, you know? And so I think those reframes were really powerful. What family drug support has done for my family is probably allowed me to be a little bit more understanding and it gave me a lot more knowledge that I didn't really have before. And it gave me probably a lot more compassion in the way in which I dealt with my family. It's quite incredible uh, when we deliver stepping stones to see the relief that families experience when they're uh, connecting with other people. They've been isolated for so long through shame and stigma and when families come into the space with Stepping Stones, it's literally a game changer. One of the things I really appreciate about this program is that it recognises that families are the expert on their own family. And while uh, information is power and wow, there was so much great information shared, uh, that really empowered me to feel like I was making the right choices for my children, for myself and for my family. At that point when I did the Stepping Stones workshop, I started having a lot of reflection about all the things that I probably missed out on and all the things that I hadn't achieved and all the things that I still wanted to do. And I thought about the sacrifice that I had made in looking after all these people. And in that, I wasn't looking after me. So I had pretty much forgotten who I was. <laughs> and even I had lost touch with lots of people because I didn't feel connected to them anymore because they didn't really understand what was, you know, what I was going through. I really appreciated the stages of change model. I uh, also helped me you know, give me a bit of a reality check. I think that I possibly thought I was further along in terms of how I was dealing with the situation than I was. Then it just also made me feel okay about where I was and that, you know, uh, that I actually spent a lot of time in the denial, in the guilt, in the shame and, uh, and in the chaos and, you know, for me, I spent a lot of time trying to control the chaos. So controlling chaos, those words really resonated for me. And then I felt like by the end of the Stepping Stones program, I could really feel um, that I was emerging into that final stage. And there was some, you know, so much hope uh, when, when I felt that, yeah. Just going through that workbook and just understanding and getting information and learning new things and just a few little pieces of information that made a huge difference 
in how I even dealt with things and how I coped, you know, because that's a hard thing to do, cope when you're dealing with all that. And I think for me, it was a real big turning point. It was a huge turning point in my life to be able to do those workshops and get the understanding and the knowledge and even reading Tony's book was fantastic about his journey with his son and wanting to make a difference, I guess, and trying to be the best support you can be to your family member, but also looking after yourself at the same time. One of the exercises we did was around self and reflecting on ourselves. And it was a, a small group activity. It felt really safe. Something in that process, it was so simple and yet I felt this huge weight shift in that moment. And it was really a coming back to myself. And so I'm so grateful to Stepping Stones. Not only does it help us shed light on our young people and their needs, but it also reminds us who we are, who we are. And you know, I know that I had lost myself in this process. And in that moment, it was like, wow, here I am again, I'm me. And it was just a really powerful transformational moment. When families uh, come into the space of Stepping Stones, they gain an understanding of some coping and resilience strategies. Um, what we often witness uh, with our family members is that they redevelop um, some coping strategies to reconnect with their person. What we've seen in this space is an extraordinary level of um, reconnection and healing of family systems. When I did the course, it really made me realise that I wanted a different life for myself. And I'd pretty much almost given up my career because I just couldn't juggle it all. It was just so, so much going on and I was giving so much to everybody and I was just giving so much of myself in so many directions that I wasn't giving anything to me. So I started doing a few more things and I started, you know, going to my hobby group and I started going for walks on the beach and I started meeting friends for coffee and I started reconnecting with my family and friends. I can't recommend the Stepping Stones program highly enough. And so if somebody was wondering or resisting, thinking about it, wherever you're at on this journey, you're completely uh, normal to be feeling what you're feeling. And yet, you know, know that there is so much uh, support and encouragement and understanding and science behind this program. And that uh, in the depths of wherever you are in this moment, that there is hope and uh, stepping onto that first stepping stone is going to make such a difference, not only for yourself, but for your family and for your loved one. I can't think of anything better you could do than to do stepping stones. It will not necessarily produce drug free, which is what a lot of families want, of course, but it will definitely give you skills and tips on how to deal with the issues. And we know from the evidence that if you do support the family, which is what Stepping Stones does, you will improve the outcome, not just for the family members, but for the substance user as well.